130th anniversary model of Romero's guitar, the Cedar version. Uh, it was brought out to commemorate the establishment of the Romero's company in 1882. Lovely guitar has a traditional 1920s era style peg head, solid rosewood back and sides, uh, a different decoration to the tie block and a unique rosette. Uh, AAA woods used throughout, a uh, very uniform cedar top. Different bracing pattern than the E-Series we've been exploring. It's a six fan, a uh, couple little fans up top. It's uh, designed to sound a little different, give you a slightly different flavor. The difference is subtle. Um, it's an intermediate level guitar and one of our most popular uh, intermediate uh, to advanced student models. What do you think of the guitar chord? Uh, it's a beautiful instrument. Um, for me, it's very similar uh, to the 2 any mm -hmm. um, in terms of quality. I guess it would be really a question of in terms of the, the subtle differences, which are pretty tough to describe because they're not so obvious. Um, I guess it would be up to uh, the player, you mm -hmm. know, in terms of that and it being the anniversary model and whatnot might make a difference. Mm -hmm. But I hear this guitar as being pretty much on par mm -hmm. with, with, with the other one. It's very good responds very well and it sounds great out of the box. I think this is right out of the box again, right? Yes, again, these are all built yeah. just weeks ago. Yeah, yes. fantastic. Very good, the 130th anniversary model. <laughs> playing the Ramirez 130th anniversary spruce top version. Spruce top, going to sound different than the cedar top. Uh, they select quite tight grain spruce for this series, so very tight uniform grain, uh, typical of European uh, alpine spruce. What did you think of it? I like it. All these guitars are really wonderful. Um, this guitar is, unlike the cedar, is a little punchier in terms of the uh, a little more clarity, a little more bell-like in terms of the, the trebles, uh, the high end. Um, doesn't seem to have the same kind of response as the cedar, mm -hmm. um, but once again this is spruce. It will open up, uh, yes. given some time. Uh, spruce a little stiffer of the two woods, so will be a little brighter, a little less responsive in the base, but tighter for the first thousand hours or so, right? Until yeah, it opens exactly. up. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. we put it on that machine that Yes, we often use the uh, tone right uh, vibrating device that wedges between the strings to speed up the process, but there's nothing better than actually playing the guitar in order to break it in, or the term we usually use, we call it opening up with time. Yeah. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> 